In today's video, I have a massive box containing a Yu-Gi-Oh collection. What's up guys, we're back with another collection video and uh, before we hop into it, we have a quick giveaway. I'm giving away these two collector 10 secret rares. I mean, Neos and Cyber Dragon. How do you beat that? All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below what you think about the collection. And also make sure to go check the community tab because I've been announcing pretty consistently, not as consistently as I thought I was going to, but pretty consistently. I have most except like maybe like nine or 10 people to ship out. We're still communicating about addresses and stuff, but make sure that if you want something, you want to make sure you see it. So go check out that community tab, see if you want to give away. Okay, let me open this box up. It's not very heavy, so I think it might be like a binder in here. It's very large, but I don't think it's actually that large of a collection. First item, Sesame Street wrapping paper. Good start. Second item, bubble wrap. Okay, enough, enough dad jokes. It seems like there's a few things in there. Um, for a second, I thought this was the only item and I was like, that's a big box for this binder, but no, there's a few other things. Let's go through this first and see what's inside. Okay, so, so far, not a lot. Wait, is there nothing in here? Oh, there we go. All right, we have a... Uh... Sacred Phoenix of Nephthys, Crystal Beast, Topaz, Tiger. I'm going to get these out real quick, and we're going to check these out. Okay, I got a sneak peek that I saw a ghost I don't know which one it was. We're going to pull these out. We're going to look at a couple of these in the conditions and stuff. Oh, the, the infamous double sleeve going the same way. <laughs> Doesn't really do anything that way. It's kind of funny when that happens. Okay, first Ed. Oh, wow. Thunder Giant. That looks pretty nice. Not like a PSA 10, but that is near mint for sure. So that is a pretty nice card. Good start to this collection. Wow, Ultimate Rare. Okay, that's pretty sweet. Got a Gear Freed the Swordmaster. Also incredible Flaming Eternity card. Front looks really good. Back, I'm guessing, is scuffed. Yeah. Okay, classic. You can kind of see it through. Even so, that's pretty nice for Flaming Eternity. So good condition on that one. Speaking of Flaming Eternity, we have another Sacred Phoenix of Nephthys. Look at that. Oh, wow. That's a beautiful card. Ultimate rare first ed. Yeah, there's that Flaming Eternity scuffing right there, but still a really awesome looking card, especially on the front. That is awesome. Sacred Phoenix of Nephthys. Got a Crystal Beast Topaz Tiger. Another pretty expensive card, Force of the Breaker Ultimate. Back is, yeah, I got a few scratches, probably like light play on this one, but still pretty nice. Wow, what a sweet card. By the way, I will probably have some of these cards listed on my website, um, assuming the purchase goes through and everything like that. Whatever I'm selling will probably be on ruxin34.com. I finally added a search bar. Thanks to Strictly Sealed for pointing out I didn't have one. So now when there's like a million items, you can search for what you're looking for. And if it's not there, you know, it'll pop up as either sold out, not listed, whatever. So, or, if, or it will be there. So hopefully that'll help all you guys who are buying on the website. I've been posting a lot more stuff there. So I appreciate all you guys checking that out. Okay, let's go to the next page. Okay, let's see. Oh, Ghost Rares. Oh, is that a Rainbow? Dra oh, that's a first edition Rainbow Dragon and first edition Power Tool. Okay. Didn't realize how nice this collection was going to be. <laughs> okay, let's pull these out. Uh, this is only six cards in. We're, this is a great start. You know what I always say? Quality over quantity. And this certainly is that. Let's go with the Power Tool first. The double sleeving is killing me. <laughs> the, the two, the same way, double sleeve. Okay, Power Tool, that is such a sweet card. Wow, that card's pretty nice. It does have a couple scratches, but like, probably qualifies as near mint still, just not like a PSA 10. This is sweet. If this, is, if this one's in that good a condition, that's gonna be crazy. Wow, Rainbow Dragon, that's beautiful. Okay, there's a few scuffs. Yeah, and like some lines, you know, and stuff, but honestly, like really good condition here. I don't actually have one of these for my binder at the moment because I have, the, you know, the graded one we pulled. Hmm, maybe this will make it in there. I'm not sure. Who knows? It's always tough to those really high end ones. You're like, I could put in the binder or I'll have to resell it, you know, because it's expensive. So tough call on that one, but it's really beautiful. That actually looks really good. Okay, let's see if there's any more cards. That might have been everything in here. Yeah, it was just six cards in this binder, I think, but high end, like big time cards. So. Honestly, a pretty good start. Okay, there's something else here in bubble wrap. Let's see what it is. I think there's a couple graded cards in here. Let's see what, okay, it was one graded card. Okay, one graded card. A lot of extra bubble wrap, which is good because after the whatnot stream, guys, and I packed like 300 orders in, over the weekend, I ran completely out of everything. Like I reordered, but it's still coming in. So I kind of need this bubble wrap. Let's see what this is. Oh, Thessalos, yeah, PSA 9, Thessalos the Firestorm Monarch, another Rise of Destiny card, pretty nice, let's see what it looks like outside the sleeve, it's a pretty cool collection, this is definitely quality over quantity, that's for sure, okay, the back is, can't tell if that's the slab or not, I'm gonna have to look, look at that, but, I mean, still, nice card, PSA 9, Thessalos, 
Rise of Destiny is tough. Got another one. I think maybe these are all just graded cards. He individually bubble wrapped these like with like three different pieces of bubble wrap. This is absolutely like to the max packaging. Like the box is way too big, way too much bubble wrap, but you can never have too much if it arrives safely, right? So I can't argue with it. All right, let's see what this one is. Oh, a Lilla. Okay, so, uh, not Lilla, sorry. Kiss a kill. Live Twin, Kiss a kill. That's a Gym Mint 10. All right, newer card. Not, I mean, not at the level of what we've been looking at, but it is a PSA 10, so it's not bad. I think these are all individually wrapped PSA cards. So there's not going to be a ton of PSA cards, but they are going to be safe. That's for sure. So that's all we really care about. And more bubble wrap for me, as I said. I need it. <laughs> I need it right now, like big time. I really needed it the other day. I was like scrounging my entire place. I was like, where's more bubble wrap? Okay, let's see what this is. Oh, Barrel Dragon. First edition PSA 9. He showed me some of these. He might have even showed me everything, but I think he showed me the graded cards at one point, and I like glanced over them, but then he sent them to me, and they've been sitting here for like three weeks. Sorry. Sorry for the delay, man. It's been a crazy few weeks. November? I did not expect November to be insane. It's been insane. Like with, with the Whatnot stream, and then like we had a bunch of other sponsors, and then we just had like a ton of new product, the Rarity Collection, and obviously one of the Valiant Smashers, that too. So yeah, Barrel Dragon, that's pretty cool. So it's been nuts. So finally, I'm able to, I mean, not Thanksgiving week, but I'm able to catch up a little bit. Okay, more... Bubbly wrap for another card. Let's see what it is. Is it new or old? Let's see if we can guess. Okay, new or old. I think this looks... I think I'm going to guess older. Okay, I was right. So GX era, Rottweiler, PSA 9, Ultimate Rare First Dead. Pretty cool. Elemental hero, like, associated card. Very nice. All right, we got more, guys. The bubble wrap is that it's a next level right now. It's crazy. This is like a whole roll of bubble wrap, I think. Bubble wrap's not cheap, by the way. So you got to get how to reuse it if you get nice bubble wrap. If it's like nasty, you, you know, it's got stuff all over, don't use that. But, you know, some of that, this looks pretty, pretty unused. Okay, an Exo Citrus. So there's a few like collector rares mixed in here. They're PSA 10, so that's good. Not going to spend too much time on the, on the new collector rares. They're cool, but obviously we're looking for that old stuff as we're opening the collection. This is going to be like a 20 card collection, but it's going to be long. I got to open all this stuff, but it's like super quality stuff. Like I haven't seen anything crappy yet. Let's see about this one. This is an older grade. Interesting. So it can't be that new. It's a 4 million cert or 40 million cert. Harpy Queen 9. Oh, that's a big 10 if you got that. Still a really nice card. Harpy Queen's pretty expensive. I bet that's like a, I guess like a $200 card, maybe 150 and a 9. Not totally sure. Pretty good card. How many more do we have left? Is there anything besides graded, I wonder? I really don't know. This thing's huge. All PSA 9 so far. So Well, on the old stuff and then 10s on the new stuff. This one was graded 41 million. Toon Mermaid. Dude, these are quality cards. These are really nice. Uh, that is some horrible centering. Look at that. Wow, I'm surprised I got a nine, actually. I mean, centering usually won't knock, knock you minus two, but sometimes it will. 40 million? Maybe not back then. More bubble wrap. I'm literally overrun by bubble wrap. It's kind of a good thing, actually. As I've said many times in this video, it's all I've talked about is bubble wrap, it feels like. Back to the 66 million certs. Let's see what this one is. Oh, another Topaz Tiger, dude. That'd be a sweet 10. Topaz Tiger's pretty awesome. It's a really expensive ultimate rare. Look, I used it in my uh, Popcorn deck on Duel Links. Duel Links, yeah. Can't be a Ruxin video without referencing Duel Links. You guys gotta know that at this point. I think we have two more cards. So this is kind of an interesting uh, video. We have, okay, one more card. Harpy Lady Sisters, first edition. So solid, I mean, these are really good. Look at what we've gotten so far. Harpy. Topaz, Toon Mermaid, Harpy Lady, Michaelis, Rottweiler, Barrel Dragon, Life Twin, and the Thestalos. I mean, those are all really good. And of course, these are absolutely insane. That leaves us with what looks like one more card. Let's see what it is. This is going to be like a like a common or something like that. The last card. This one might be a newer card. Well, no, maybe not. I'm not sure. Oh, Necros 9. Wow, there's some sweet cards. Yeah, okay. That's pretty sweet. Exodia Necros, ultra rare from Dark Crisis. That is absolutely awesome. So, oh my goodness. Let me double check. There's nothing else in this box. All right, guys, because this is a shorter video, I don't want it to be like an eight minute video because I just feel like I want it, I always want it to be like 12 to 14 minutes or something just so it's a little bit longer for you guys. We're going to throw in a couple bonus packs here. So we're going to open a 2017 reprint pack and some ghosts from the past to get that Dark Magician. Just real quick, just so you guys... You know, it's not too short of a video because I know whenever I see a video, it's like eight minutes. I'm like, man, that was short. So let's let's add a little bonus on it. It was a great collection. Just, I mean, quality over quantity, as we said. Let's see if we can just make a little quality pull real quick to uh, top it off. We have a Dragoonity Knight. I, I doubt it's going to happen with this Ghost from the Past, to be honest, because you guys know how it goes. But I'm running low. I said, like, I mean, we're not at a lot of packs left. I can't. I can only do this a couple more times. Sunbind Healer. Time Thief Flyback. I'm just hoping there's a uh, Heels Unruh. 
Ghost Rider in here. Come on. Okay, Starry Night, Starry Dragon. Okay. Gotta do a couple of packs here. Let's see. To add into the collection. Let's see what we can pull. Sun Sea Genius. We have Sunvine Gardena. Laval Ball Dragon. Hieratic Seal. We're gonna do Whirlwind. That's it. Oh, that was the fifth card. Okay. That LLB pack's gonna have a blue eyes too. So Dark Magician and Dark Magician pack right now. Here it goes. Here we go. Oh, it's ripping apart. We have Dragoonity Draft. We have Hieratic Dragon. Time Thief. Photon Thrasher. Dragoonity Glow. So what do we have? We have a total of four or eight packs total out of Ghost from the Past. That's enough. That's enough for the Ghost Rare. Easily. Easily. Gear Town. Mine Mole. The Underminer. We have Emergency Teleport. Good card, finally. Time Thief. Starry Night, Starry Dragon. Okay. Firewall Dragon Pack. Bless us with a Ghost Rare right now. It will happen. Tackle Crusader. We have Buster Dragon. Miss Valley. Monarchs Erupt. And the Vampire the Void. Okay. Don't forget, guys, check out Ruxin34.com. There's a lot of cards available there. A lot of these cards that we purchased will be available as well. Sun Ablon Dryas, Xyz Burst. We have Update Jammer. Heals and Root. And. Hieratic Seal. Oh my goodness, one more chance. But yeah, make sure to check it out. The website, I'm trying to update it and make it a little bit better. I know it's a, you know, it's a little primitive. It's not like the best looking website ever, but the important part is that you can get your cards that you want, right? That's what matters. Last pack for Ghost in the Past. Here we go. e -tally again. We got two of those. We got the Time Thief, Sunseed, Sunvine, Trinity Glow. Last pack magic. Here we go. To top this off, Legend of Blue Eyes, White Dragon. 2017 edition two three four swap that around we have dark world thorns lay into medulla rux and special that's our super rux and special yami witty phantom king fog electro whip frenzy panda giant soldier of stone and Dark Magician Blue Eyes, Exodia, you know Thomas Soul. All right, well, it was fun. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and make sure to check out Ruxin34.com. Shout out to Tomefo Show, Daxer, Tomato Juice, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Doyster, Supreme Sage 21, CJ, Liu, Gwine 62, Yu Gi Oh! Unboxed, and Natai Show, Ian Musa Jr. Bardic, Robert F., Thomas McLean, and Changa Lang. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.